Okay, it's around 10.20, September 15th, 2004, Wednesday. You can see uh, a little bit of wind. It's fairly cloudy. It's a slight sprinkle. Quite a few people are still uh, roaming the streets for no particular reason. See the uh, hibiscus and the live oak already starting to move a little bit. Nothing, nothing major quite yet. <laughs> uh, they've got it predicted between us and Mobile. More than likely more Mobile unless it goes a little bit more easterly. So, uh, we will see how the day goes. This will be the first hurricane that I have taped ever. Okay, it's 10.39, September 15, 2004. Uh, just a few minutes have passed, really. The uh, wind has picked up. It's definitely raining a little harder getting some uh, pretty steep gusts and uh, you can see it a little bit more now you hear a few things over in the bo boat yard kind of uh, rattling around may not be able to pick it up on this but uh, definitely uh, definitely picking up very quickly I am hoping that that uh, live oak actually makes it through. I've got it tied down pretty good, but hibiscus, I don't know. <laughs> they are probably not going to make it, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. You never know with trees and stuff like that. Um, some of the neighbors are still here. Still have people on the road being fairly stupid. Not sure why. But uh that's about it. I kind of expect it to worsen fairly quickly as it progresses into the early afternoon. Alright, it's about 11.48, September 15, 2004. Uh, not as much wind, oddly enough. Still raining lightly. Uh, you can't see it through the video, but uh, rain is moving slightly more horizontal than just straight down. There are tiny little gusts, but you can tell the trees aren't moving. <coughs> Flags are going a little bit, but nothing major. You can tell by the hibiscus and the live oak. Not a whole lot going on. Cars still zooming down the road like they got some place to go in a hurricane. Every once in a while you get a little cooler breeze. But uh, as you can tell, not a whole lot going on. I guess we'll give it a few more hours and see how it goes. I will uh, keep it updated. All right, it is. It is now 3:13, September 15, 2004. We just had our first power hiccup, but it's not off yet. Uh, winds have picked up. It's been raining fairly constantly since the last time. It's not raining super hard at the moment. It comes and goes. The uh, wind, though, has definitely picked up, as you can tell. It's going in pretty good gusts. The boats are making a little noise. The uh, 
live oak, taking a little bit more beating as are the hibiscus. Let's see how long they last. Hopefully, hopefully last for a while. But uh, definitely, uh, definitely starting. And people are still on the road. Yeah. Nothing better to do. So um, anyway, definitely getting some gusts. The rain is going more horizontal again. But uh, it has begun, I believe. So uh, currently a little less than 200 miles. Under Mobile, traveling perfect north now. Okay, uh, it is now September 16th, 2004. We're still getting winds. Uh, I was really not expecting this. There is just destruction everywhere. <laughs> Uh, that fence, like I figured, wouldn't hold up. There are parts of the uh, of our shed right there. That piece right there, and that piece right there. Um, three limbs everywhere. Those little speckles that you see are part of the roof. <laughs> and that is the roof. Pretty much like that all the way around. Fire tree, per my predictions, not very nicely. Held up pretty nice. But uh, this neighborhood, it is it's pretty worn torn, actually. A couple of trees. Seem like they're still there, but uh, probably it's been uprooted. I look at it. Yep. I'll be able to fix it. Yeah. They put up a damn good fight, but uh, I think they lost. The live oak. It is still rooted, but. Uh, it uh, it's bent quite a bit. But it's still on the ground. So I'm gonna try to ride it. And here is what's left of the trees of the house. The one lamp post made it pretty good. A little bent. A little wobbly. <laughs> Post held pretty good though. And then of course, you know, there's just free crap everywhere. Oh, there's one down one. Nothing hit her house. Uh, now I had a pretty good cry over this one. The, uh, the main tree is gone. Really gone. There's parts of it on the roof, parts of it down there. As you can see though, the house held up pretty damn good. All the windows are still in good shape. These trees are just unbelievable. Burnt for Chris, bending every which way, but they are still up. Surrounded by a lot of tile, but they're still up. The deck, well, <laughs> the deck's still here, minus that part right there. Oh, and that thing. Uh, my rope lights, I hope they held up pretty good. The, uh, Grill, there is the grill. And then the house, not a window broken. Grill cover, Mary, as usual, still standing. But uh, 
You know, van's room, doing good. Even parts of the house, the damn tree hit. Still there. But that is just unbelievable. I cannot believe that. I, that just makes me absolutely sick. Absolutely sick. Come on. Oh, somebody's trying to attack me. That's good. All right, on to the deck. Look at that. God, that absolutely makes me want to throw up. Just throw up. Beautiful tree. Just gone. Absolutely, and the one closest to the house, too. The one absolutely closest to the house, and it was not hitting the house. I'll be damned if this house was going to get hit by anything big. Of course, that one got hit. Let's see. But you know what? I don't see any structural damage, just a lot of tiles. Of course, tiles in the back are still good. But, uh, of course, that one probably came from that tree right there. A lot of hell. This tree, I've seen better days too, actually. What a mess. What a mess. Chairs are still there. Yay! Oh, look at that. Swing set got bent. What a mess. The bench is still holding. I'll fix that live oak, though. Definitely. Oh. Alright. Well. God. Damn rope. So, this tree is gone. This is going to be one bright backyard now. This tree, I uh, got one, one limb right there, still there. Needs to come down. One right there. Here we put a lot of debris in the neighbor yard. But uh, it's gonna be one hell of a mess. Look at that. Can't even salvage that limb. God, what a mess. What a mess. And of course the wash shed, there 30 years, there another 30 more. We walk around the yard. Absolutely incredible. These trees. <laughs> Unbelievable. Look that live oak lives. Look at this. <laughs> everywhere. Just tree parts everywhere. Ah, damn. This thing, that's salvageable. More tree parts. The magnolias are still standing. What the hell is that? Oh, oh, what is that? Oh. Somebody's nice thing of some sort. <laughs> Another tree. A lot of trees. Oh, look at that one. Look at that. Right in half. Right in half. Fence kind of jacked up. This is another shame right here. Look at that. Totally up. Totally up. Beautiful tree. Gone. Is that still there? Another house kind of jacked up. Oh! That tree hit that truck, I bet. No, it didn't. Never mind. Still there. And my damn light post. Damn it! Look at that. Post is still there. Just demolished that pretty light. Bastard. Oh well. Hickory nuts everywhere. Squirrel's gonna have a field day. Look at that. That whole tree. That could have been on the house. That whole thing could have been on the house. <gasps> that tree is bent. To go check that out. Look at this. Look at the amount of, of area now that's around the house. No trees. Used to be trees everywhere. Trees over there that came down because they died. These trees decimated. That tree gone. Limbs everywhere. Oh, there's some of the damn stuff. 
This thing is still there. Greenhouse looks good, as usual. Well, there's the roof of the uh, other shed, which we'll come around to in a minute. More things uprooted. Chair. <laughs> I cannot believe. Look at those baskets I have. Stuff everywhere. These Christmas stuff. Not stuff on balls. Christmas stuff. There's people, of course, parking the yard, so checking out their boat. Um, mostly in the front. And other things somewhere. So they, uh, These trees held up pretty good. I like. The cars held up. I don't see any damage. The windows are good. A lot of crap roll all over them, but the cars look pretty good. The cars pretty good. And of course, windows. Windows are intact. You can't hurt 500-year-old windows, apparently. Backs of the cars. No, no, the cars look pretty good. Hit with a branch. Might be a scratch here or there, but these guys. That might be a problem. This part of the house leaked very slightly. I just don't know if it leaked on top or the wind was blowing it underneath or with a leak. On this part is probably right about there, up here. In front of the house, look at that, windows. Now you have to understand these windows. I mean, the windows are right there. And they held out pretty good. This is amazing. Part of the fence is gone. Well, not really amazing because I knew it was going to blow down. And then, of course, my coping's blown down. Kind of pissed. Didn't hold. Very. Oh, wait a minute. Very irritating. What I'm doing is I'm checking the roof, front porch. That has bent slightly. Let's check the crack. 